Hey Gemini, this is Ascension Empress with your June mid-month general reading. So please take what resonates with you. We're going to get right into it. Ooh, <laughs> oh, wow, of course. Um, welcome if you are new. Thank you all so much for your support, your love, your patience. Please like, share, and subscribe. And welcome. Ooh, wow. Okay, Gemini. We gonna get right into it. <laughs> yeah, I just got an energy around. No, no more people pleasing. Okay, or you, or you're shifting your energy. Okay, it's like you don't have a problem giving your time and energy still, but you are definitely going to be making it very clear to this energy that it's not that. All right. Hmm. Okay. Well, may peace and blessings be upon everyone. Guess we starting. Okay, let's see. What messages do we have from my sun, moon, and rising Gemini? Overlaying the reading, please. Ooh, I like the sun card and the three of swords. Okay, so yeah, somebody's choosing them. Someone's definitely choosing them. I feel an energy around a separation um, within a relationship or just who you used to give your time and energy, maybe even attention to. Okay, and this is the attention seeker. You got the sun card here. And I feel with the separation, you know, there could have been an issue in the past. Some heartbreak, some heartache that was due to this inconsistency, um, lack of reciprocity. Um, I'm also hearing you weren't there when, you know, you were feeling like this. Somebody wasn't there while you were experiencing the Three of Swords. Maybe that they have caused. Okay, but now you definitely seem to have a lot of clarity on what you um, will not be dealing with going forward. All right, and what you want in your space is what I'm hearing. What messages do we have for this Three of Swords? Yeah, you got the Six of Cups. So whoever this three of swords is to you they definitely want to come back in want to reconcile um i feel that you provide the sun to them but again like i see this person wants attention all right let's see what do we need to know about the sun energy see i've seen the devil card yeah look at that judgment mm. Mm. <laughs> Hoo yeah something may also be found out Let's see. What messages are going into the past? What messages do we have? For wow. Okay, you have the Ace of Cups. Yep. Ooh. The Queen of Wands, the Moon, the Strength card, and the Hangman. Definitely. Definitely. As soon as I said something may be found out and what's going to the past, a lot. A lot of secrecy. Um, I'm hearing other relationships, other emotional connections as well. Okay, lack of strength, lack of discipline, and that separation. So this Three of Swords, I feel like it's just lingering because a decision was made. Many of y'all decided to stick with you, okay, in your conviction. You took charge of the situation. I feel like some of y'all know intuitively. Some Somebody tried to keep you a secret. Yeah, somebody definitely tried to keep you a secret. Wow. Now, I feel this person wants to come back in because... You did offer them your time, genuine, I mean, Six of Pentacles and Six of Cups energy. But they were inconsistent. Let's see. Whew, wee. What messages do we, ooh, yeah. Okay, so that Nine of Wands, <laughs> I swear, this is like his cousin or his brother. All right, because the Knight of Swords has been popping up out of nowhere lately. It's just been, he been so consistent. It's like when the Knight of Wands ain't in town, Knight of Swords is like, I got you. Okay, or again, these different masks, especially with the Magician card here and the Knight of Cups, you know, trying to show up and, you know, have access in any kind of way. You got the Knight of Cups here, the Knight of Swords, and the Knight of Wands. All right, the only thing you're missing is the Knight of Pentacles, which is slow moving. And I would make it, would, it definitely makes sense as to why the Knight of Pentacles ain't here. If you the Queen of Pentacles, all right, somebody here is, again, you're seen as stable. You're seen as strong, self-sufficient, reliable, okay? So this Knight of Wands is definitely, you know, some narcissistic energy. They must have thought you was going to be some supply, but they probably didn't know that you saw right through them as well with the Gemini. Yeah, I said with the Gemini, so maybe, ooh, y'all, that eclipse had everybody intuition on. I mean, phew. <laughs> But this moon card, so maybe that's what it is. Had you seen right through them. Okay, and it does make sense because y'all did have, oh, yeah, the energy around being narcissistic. So, that yeah, that's the blow. Now they're trying to come back in. Lord, let's see. 
What do you want my Gemini's to be aware of when it comes to this delay, the separation, this time of contemplation? Okay, you. <laughs> I'm here. Know that your wishes are still going to be granted. Know that you're still blessed. You're still protected. And, and keep this energy of gratitude. Okay, many of y'all are in it. That's why you're in this Queen of Pentacles, not phase. Again, big as a blow to that ego. Indifferent, indifference. Okay, choosing not to give them any attention. Not to acknowledge their existence. Alright, let's see. Y'all, ain't that the truth? Okay, you cut right through it. Y'all are becoming extremely clear. Extremely clear. Very clairvoyant. This Queen of Swords energy and the Ace of Swords energy. Hmm. Why is this Ace of Swords here, Spirit? Why is this Ace of Swords here? Wow, I told you. I told you. Very. Wow, I'm here all knowing. That's why it's all well. Wow, yes. Mm. I'm speechless, y'all. So what's the overall message for my Gemini? Again, straightforward, to the point. To the point. <laughs> if anybody keep you waiting, if anybody act like they can't make a decision, I think it was Taurus, you know, just making the decision for them. But also, you know, some of y'all playing it, you just playing that role. Okay, it's only a matter of time for you just go ahead and set one sword down. You know, so they may think that you don't know what to do or that you you still heartbroken or whatever. Okay, but in a minute, you're going to tap in because you're the high priestess, clearly. You're going to set that sword down. You're going to take that blindfold off. <laughs> it's going to be over with. It's going to be over with. All right, so let's see. Whew. What is the overall moonology message? Overall moonology for my Gemini's. Overall moonology. Wow. Okay. Yeah. You are very close to achieving your goal. Mm. Y'all, I'm so excited for y'all. So let me know how this resonates with you. I wish you all well. There will be a special coming up in a few days. So stay tuned and take care, you all. Bye.